Hey, what's up guys? In today's video, we're gonna be looking at the Niles Reefer Test Kit Series. So as you guys can see, they have calcium, nitrate, magnesium, phosphate, and carbonate hardness. I'll be explaining why testing is important. So first, let's talk about calcium. Both soft corals and hard corals require calcium for healthy growth. And the larger your corals grow, and spread the more calcium they will need. Magnesium is needed to help maintain the correct combination of calcium and alkalinity. Definitely want to keep your phosphate levels in check so you can keep unsightly algae from popping up in your aquarium. Carbonate hardness and alkalinity is crucial for marine aquariums as it has a collective relationship with calcium, pH, and coral growth. And last but definitely not least, Nitrates. Extremely high nitrates are almost always an indicator of bad water quality. If you want to keep your fish and demanding SPS corals healthy and stay away from bad algae growth, you definitely want to keep your nitrates in check. So I decided to do this video because I've never used the Niles test kits before and they're supposed to be really simple to use. So I decided to go with the nitrate test kit for you guys so I can demonstrate if it's easy to use, if it's hard to use and then give you guys my opinion on it. First, we take the two clear valves and fill both of them with five milliliters of aquarium water and then put one of them to the side. We will then place five drops of the first reagent into one of the valves and shake that bad boy up a little. Next, we'll use the powdered reagent. Take one scoop and place in the valve. Now we're gonna have a little shake party for one minute. Now we set the valve down and wait five minutes. Just enough time to make a sandwich. Our five minutes are up. Place both valves in the holder, putting the valve that has no reagents over the color chart and the other valve on the blank side. I have to say, for me, this test was really easy to read and I'm guessing it's due to the extra colors available. It seems that my nitrate levels are between 3 and 5 milligrams. Niles recommends a nitrate level under 20 milligrams, so I am all good. We would love to hear your experiences with NIOS test kits in the comments below. If you don't use NIOS, let us know your favorite test kits and why. If you would like to pick up these test kits or learn more about them, check out the links in the description below or visit saltsupply.com.